Hello everybody, thank you so very much for being here and listening my channel, Ivana Tero. This is weekly tarot reading for astrological sign Aquarius. My dear Aquarius, is both female and male, thank you very much for stopping by. New week in front of us, which starting with the date March 21st till March 27, 2016. My dear friends, this week is a very special one because we do celebrate Easter Day. Christians worldwide celebrate Easter. It is the most festive event. We commemorate Jesus Christ's resurrection from death, as written in Bible. It is a day of joy because Jesus Christ is risen, defeated death for all of us. My dear friends, as you can see, I already shuffle my cards in front of us as usual. We have five tarot cards in our weekly tarot reading spread and I will try to do my best to translate those tarot symbols and messages for you. Before I begin, I only want to remind you, please listen not only your sun sign but also your moon and your rising sign as well. Why? Because among those three stories, probably you will find one story which is going to be the most resonated with your own private life. So, my dear Aquariuses, let's get started. Major Arcana, the Fool, Seven of Swords, Ace of Swords, Major Arcana, Wheel of Fortune, and Four of Wands. My dear friends, Aquariuses, what this spread is all about, what you can expect uh, in uh, your work department, what you can expect. First of all, I think with Ace of Swords, you know, being here at a middle position, I think this is a very important tarot card for you. Why? Because finally, you will speak what you think. Not, uh, not that I'm trying to say that you are very hush-hush about who you are and about your ideas and about your visions. No, 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 no. But you will change something from inside of you. Something is going to be, you know, changed. You ain't gonna spend, you know, too much time uh, on explanations again, 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 and again, and, and, and again to those people who cannot even understand you, who you are, and what you want to achieve. And, you know, people cannot understand you are not living in 21st century. You live already in 22nd century, so this is why. So basically, new ideas, new approach, first of all, to yourself, toward yourself, you know, and finally saying to yourself, I cannot cope with those kind of people anymore. Nope, I'm done. And that's it. So basically, everything during this week, started with Ace of Swords. Honey, you know, leave me alone. Leave me alone. I do not care what you have to say. With Seven of Swords, this is you trying to escape. And maybe you will try to escape some kind of, you know, responsibilities. Because you will think, you know, inside of you, in your mind, that this is so boring, you know, and many Aquariuses will find themselves, you know, trying to, to escape, just to run away as far as you can. And please do not forget, you have Major Arcana the Fool, you know. Again, this is you running far away from your responsibilities, far away from those people who are maybe even, you know, as stupid, people who cannot understand you. People who are not willing to change from inside and out, you know. Because you do want to change and you do want to explain other people. Honey, try to see, try to understand, you know. You can talk with me, you can talk with uh, other people. Uh, you can uh, you can uh, read some book. But but please do something, you know, in order to, to develop yourself. But I'm afraid... With the Seven of Swords, this is finally you saying, okay, you do not want to change yourself. I really cannot help you then. Then, you know, 
kiss and goodbye and this is you this is you maybe even you know abandoning somebody who cannot understand you abandoning somebody that uh, you cannot uh, you know speak with so basically new adventure is just about to happen new adventure is in front of you just about you know some doors are going to be open for you but please do not try to uh, reconnect yourself with people coming uh, from your past because uh, uh, try to understand you abandon that people because they also are not on your energetic level so maybe you cannot find now somebody who can understand you but believe me also you cannot find you know somebody who can understand you in your past no listen you have a wheel of fortune you have wheel of fortune in april you will find new group of people who are going to be most likely not most likely but i know i can see that they are going to be on your level because you have four of ones so basically this is you you know trying to break free this is your routine and you are not so very pleased with your work you know routine you do not want routine you want new challenge you want new people you want your friends you you basically want a new life and believe me with the major arcana wheel of fortune this is exactly what you can get okay maybe not now in this week maybe not even in march but believe me in uh, april and especially middle of april this is like after 10th of april new group of people will just you know be presented in front of you just like that and basically all you have to do you have to uh, you have to to change once again you have to shift a little bit your your thoughts and with your thoughts you will attract new people this is about this is about your job so many aquariuses will uh, change your company you will change um, your approach toward what you work and i think many aquariuses will uh, change all together you will find something new in your life and you will you will pursue on this path for those you know aquarius who uh, are already coupled uh, female or male maybe you have spouse at your home and maybe your spouse does not understand you and basically you know story is very uh, similar one honey <laughs> I try to I try to to explain to you like a thousand time again again and again but I really think you cannot understand me and this is you running away from your home but uh, uh, in a household I know that somebody is awaiting on you so be very you know cautious about you you know if you already have your uh, current partner like a husband maybe your wife because uh, your partner also easily can run away so if you are not ready to lose your partner then be you know a little bit uh, you know uh, how can i describe that um don't pursue only your vision but try to include your current partner in your ideas and uh, in in your in your wishes visions maybe you will find out that now your current partner already is ready to join you you never know you never know so basically before you just run away from your household talk with your spouse because with the wheel of fortune most likely your uh, spouse is going to be eager to sell your business to sell your house to, to sell your properties you know to go and 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 uh, and and wander you know around the world um, trying to, to to figure what is your next step but together with you so this whole spread is about you know abandoning something something which is old new uh, you know old thoughts uh, old uh, habits um, uh, old house uh, old car old people uh, old friends and you are just about you know for being ready 
after 10th of, uh, of, uh, of um, uh, April to start big adventure of your own. But if you love your partner still, then please, please, please include your partner because most likely Aquarius, maybe you already have, you know, spouse who is very look like you. So basically, both you and your partner, both you and your partner can run far away from your old house, from old problems, from from all the uh, gossips, uh, you know, and those kind of things. And what about single Aquariuses? Do you have chance to meet somebody? Yes, of course you can. But when you meet somebody new, please explain during this week, especially, this is very important, please do explain. You know, I'm not, you cannot anchor me. Because I want to travel, I want to, to run away, I want to run, I want to mingle with another people, I have many, many friends. So either you are going to join me, either you're going to join us, because you know, I cannot promise you that uh, every single day I be home at, uh, I don't know, 7 p.m. I cannot declare that, I cannot promise you that. So either you are want to enjoy with me and with my friends, or either, honey, I'm not, you know, material, love material for you all together. But when you really fall in love, when you really, really fall in love, you will understand that you will change something inside of you. So basically, some Aquariuses will uh, meet somebody very special during this week, and this person is going to be uh, even uh, um, even a bigger bigger um, what is the word fugitive even bigger fugitive from committed love relationship than you are. And basically, when you meet this type of person, oh my God, you will fall in love, and now you know the whole story is going to be you know changed just like that, and you will run. You will try to stop your new love partner because now you are going to be very willing to stay in committed love relationship. So basically everything everything during this week is going to be, you know, like going up, upside down, upside down, upside down. And this is very interesting, my dear Aquarius, when you really uh, fall in love you will find yourself in a situation that you are going to run after your partner and you are going to you are going to want you know to have a love nest for the two of you and let me tell you just this you are going to enjoy very much so the very best partner for you can be libra gemini but then again leo sagittarius or and Aries. So, my dear Aquarius, this is your weekly tarot reading. If you like this video, then play, press like button. You can share this video, of course, with your friends. And please do subscribe on my channel. Until next week, take care. Bye-bye.